to the few things I had learned so far on the way to my true aim in life. This new thing was now added. A surrendering to nature's irrational forms produces in us a feeling of inner harmony with the will that gave rise to these forms. We soon feel the temptation of thinking of them as being our own moods, our own creations, and see the boundaries separating us from nature begin to quiver and dissolve. We become acquainted with that state of mind in which we are unable to decide whether the images on our retina are the result of external impressions or come from within. In no other way than through this practice do we discover so simply and easily how very creative we are. How much our soul always participates in the perpetual creation of the world. For it is the same indivisible divinity that is active through us and in nature. Yes, every natural form is latent within us, originates in the soul, whose essence is eternity, whose essence we cannot know, but which most often intimates itself to us as the power to love and create. 